We're here live out, outside the Metropolitan Correction Center here in Lower Manhattan. The New York Post uh, reporting this morning that Jeffrey Epstein, the 66 year old finance multimillionaire, was found on the floor of his jail cell this morning, nearly unconscious, or late last night, I should say, nearly unconscious with wounds to his neck. He has been taken to a nearby hospital here in Lower Manhattan somewhere, uh, and he is reportedly on suicide watch. Uh, what we don't know at this point is, was this really a suicide attempt? There is speculation going around about what this could be. It could have been a suicide attempt. It could have been an attack by another inmate, perhaps, maybe just a ploy to get out of this jail, which we understand is just a horrible conditions, a horrible place to have to stay, especially compared to the lifestyle that Jeffrey Epstein was living up until just a couple of months ago. Epstein, of course, arrested on July 6th uh, for charges of sex trafficking. Prosecutors allege he abused dozens of girls over the years, young underage girls over the years. Some of those alleged victims have been speaking out recently. Uh, Epstein had connections, many big, powerful connections to people like former President Bill Clinton, to Prince Andrew. There is a whole catalog of people, even the president, Donald Trump, used to have a relationship with him until he said he had to kick him out of Mar-a-Lago for inappropriate behavior with an underage girl. Um, he's facing 45 years in prison for this. He has been denied bail uh, because of his wealth and his connections. We'll keep you posted. We have calls into the jail and to Epstein's attorneys. We'll keep you posted if anything develops. Guys, we'll send it back to you. All right. Rob Schmidt, thank you very much.